Right then, folk, welcome back to another video beer review. Again, joined by James, the Frampant Line Reviews. And today we've got another, the final mystery beer um, from Adam, Mersey Beers. Um, yeah, there we go. It is a buckle. He loves it, the use of the word buckle, with a white crown on it. Thankfully, not hand capped. What so, is a buckle? A buckle. It's a buckle of beer. Oh, okay. Um, so yeah, it's is it one of these foreign Mersey words. Uh, it's a seaside mark word. Mm, okay. But uh, yeah, buckle of beer, like you do the eyes. Um, you have a bottle opener. Are you there? Are you there? There we go. And watch out for yeah, nice exclusiveness. A little bit of smoke. Oh, touch of smoke on the opening. Uh, it's it's brown in colour. That's probably a bitter. It's a dark ale. I was too dark for a bit of that. Your cat's at her feet drinking the beer. That's fine. She can enjoy it. Oh, hey, the fat one. <laughs> um, oh, I smell way nicer than the absolute shite of a beer that we had first. Single. Um, sediment. Oh, lovely. Sediment. Hmm. More flavour. <laughs> Extra flavour. <laughs> More protein. So, chestnutty. Yeah. Uh, oh, no, like mahogany. Unstained mahogany yeah. colour in this one. Uh, yeah, smells. That's a bitter. That's an English bitter. It's not. It's too dark. Black treacle. Way too dark for a bitter. You sure? Yeah. Brown ale? Brown ale. I'm, yeah, I'm going brown. Brown or a shit porter. Um, I don't think it's dry enough to be a porter. It's a bit too sweet. Mm. Confused porter. Um, a 30 shilling. I never know. Mm. Actually, smells quite nice in fairness. I'm trying to think what has a white cap. Not many breweries use white crowns on their on mm -hmm. their beers. Um, it's either like, it could it be a mild or is it a bit I'm, too dry I'm, for I'm a mild? Think, I'm thinking mild, but mm. it's it's got a bit too much for a mild because um, it is quite roasty kind of. Could be this? Could it not be? Can you not get miles that are like five or six percent? Because they're normally four and a half, aren't they? Yeah, the only the only one that could be like that. I mean, it's not this color as Sarah Hughes mm. Ruby Mild, which is about six percent. Export mild. <laughs> export <laughs> a mild to export to the fucking British lands. Um, I actually quite like the smell. It does smell really nice, toasty. I mean, yeah, brown bread. You could see a little bit of rye bread in there yeah. as well. Toasty brown sugar, yeah. oily caramel, English hops. Yeah, absolutely. You know, yeah. earthy, herbal, and um, more of an oily grassiness. Um, a little bit of floral character. Uh, fruitiness is like you've got a wee bit of like oily pear. Well, quite a lot of oily pear. Yeah. Um, there's a wee bit of a datey thing yeah. in there. It's yeah. It's not red fruity. No, no, it's not. Datey, um, peary. Very. Is it, I'm thinking raisins, but it's, it's you know sultana. Sort Sulta of yeah, sultana. I'd agree yeah. with that. Yeah. Not red. It's not red not fruity. Red. It's more like no. an orange, like yeah. an oily thing there. <laughs> oh, the cat cats are fighting. cat fight. Yeah. Um, we'll dive in, I think. Yeah, slime jar. Cheers. Oxidised deal. Very uh, slight. That's man. mild. I'm, my mind's really saying mild now. I, yeah. I'm thinking. It's, yeah, it's not quite grainy enough to be a bit, no. isn't it? That's the main difference between a mild. Milds are a bit smoother. Mm. But it's not the sweetest of milds either. My mind initially said, my mind initially said it's Green King XX Mild, and that's just on the nose. And now I think I'm going to go with, I think it's Holden's Black Country Mild. Mm. I could have almost nailed it, but I think they've got black crowns on their beers. Or it could be Hobson's Mild or something like that. I would have no idea, to be quite honest with you. Not Mild is a style I don't really come across very often. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna say mild. I'm gonna go around three. It tastes like it's gonna be it's, yeah, it's gonna be three point eight or four. Yeah, I, I, absolute tops three and a half. I'd say. Um, Session ale. It's all water ale. <laughs> um, I mean, it's it's kind of like the, this one's one of these beers where it fits in exactly with the aroma. Bit of bread yeah. crust, bit of rye bread, wholemeal brown bread, wee touch of woodiness. Toasty brown sugary layer, a little bit of oily caramel, but dry caramel yeah. in the middle. Earthy, her earthy at the back, herbal on the sides. Wee bit floral, wee bit grassy. Then the kind of fruits we were talking. Yeah. Has got a wee bit more red fruit on the impact. It's mm. got a wee bit of a red fruity thing. But yeah, it's dry, relatively dry. A nice bitterness, chocolatey notes. 
um, bit of caramel, all quite wishy-washy, <laughs> it always is with a mild in a bottle, mm. on cast that would be lovely. Mm. It's yeah. not quite, I mean for the difference between a brownie or the brownie is going to be a bit bolder than that mm. isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to go like a Holden's or something like that. Holden's, I don't know where they go, Holden's or, uh, I mind, I can't remember, it's Hobson's do a mild. I don't know either of these breweries. Um, but yeah, mild, definitely mild. Come on, get mild. North Star. Oh, you're fucking joking. It's my old brewery. <laughs> Silky old. You doesn't recognise your own ale. It was a very long time ago. And again, I'd be amazed if that's 4.5%. Mm. Or was it 4.5? 4. 4.5. You want to see something funny? You want to see something funny? <laughs> um, hey, he's got something. <laughs> it's the old branding of Mostar. It's a foreign ale. It'd be interesting to do a versus of that now. Mm. This is best before July 21. <laughs> <laughs> this one's best before... Uh, July 23. June 23. So it's just... I'd have never thought that was that. Mm. I really thought it was a mild. Yeah. It doesn't It's not... I mean, for me, that's not dry enough to be a porter. No. It's not a very good interpretation of a porter. Yeah. It mm. I'd, I'd, yeah. No. No. <laughs> no. But you got me again. Yeah. See you next one.